The Live Strong program through the YMCA is a program that brings uh, cancer survivors or patients in. Um, it doesn't matter if they're beginning treatment, mid-treatment, post-treatment. Most of us, like myself, uh, I went through eight months of chemotherapy and you end up going through your treatment, going home and sitting for a week, you know, and then going back and getting another treatment and sitting for a week. This program enabled me to get out of the house, to get out of bed, to be with other people, and to feel that I had a sense of control over how I was feeling and what I was doing. We bring everybody together and we offer some photos that people are able to talk about what's going well in their life and some challenges they face as well. And we do that in the very first day. When those people get into a room together, the people automatically begin to understand some of the challenges that they share. Um, they understand that people are in the same boat that they are in currently, and they immediately bond to one another. Cancer is such a personal thing, um, and how you deal with it is so personal. And by, be, by being able to get together as a group, you can start talking about your issues and what problems you've been through and what they are going through. I think that helps a lot to be able to just talk it out. We have stories from cancer survivors who had lost hope and who have regained hope through our program. Cancer survivors who weren't able to raise their hands above their arms who now are able to do that. Other people that said their lower back was hurting them and now it's not hurting them anymore. And so just really overcoming some physical issues that kind of instill hope in you. This gives you something to look forward to, to get out. Most of the time when you have a diagnosed with cancer, you get a lot of things go through your mind, but there's a lot of things that don't. I think without the List Arm program, I'd still probably be curled up in bed trying to get my head out from underneath the covers. They don't have to be in a hospital setting. They can come where they can find fellowship, they can find friends, people with common interests in an environment that they trust. The YMC, I think, just is the ideal place for that. In three to five years, I hope that we are able to collect enough funds in our community that we can replicate this program in every YMCA in Tulsa, Wausau, Broken Arrow, and Bixby. I've been out of chemotherapy just a couple months and out of radiation just about six weeks, and I feel really good.